I got serious munchies. Any chips left? Dude, you scarfed the whole fucking bag. Have another hit. Yeah, yeah. I packed a fat bowl. You're getting tired, babe. You shouldn't me. Had a long death to lick ducks. I took both roads everywhere. Whoa. They went. You see that shit? It's a fucking UFO. I'm oh, serious, man. Look. They're finally coming to take you back. Tripped on a few words, but y'all are baked, so I'm good. <laughs> good job, sis. So beautiful. Damn. Why you ain't rich and famous? <laughs> I mean, you can hook us up. Hmm. I love your voice. Meow. <laughs> Thanks, everyone. I take ass, cash, or grass. <laughs> hint, hint. Sean, take a puff and pass it to your friend. Hmm. Um, sure. Oh nein. I'll take a hit. Oh nein, der Kleine wird das sehen und ah, verdammt. Der Bruder sitzt ja mit am Lagerfeuer. Es war nicht so gut. Das hat er sich gemerkt. Ah, der ist neun, der darf noch nicht. Nein, Daniel, der ist neun. No fucking way. How come you can, but I can't? Because I said so. Nein, weil er erst neun ist. That is all for us. We must sleep. Ah, there go the party animals. What is it? Like ten o'clock? No worry, Finn. We'll party like rock stars tomorrow for our last night. Come on, one more round. Gonna sleep tight. Jeez, I swear every time you play that song, Cass, I see my poor black flag. Oh man. I'm sorry. Who's Black Flag? It was my dog back in Colorado until last year. Yeah, something like that. A year ago, we were hopping a train, just me, Finn, and Cass, and Black Flag. We got caught stealing some shit in some random town. Motherfuckers called the cops on us. I had to run for it. We saw that train from afar and went straight at it. Cops were right behind us. We barely made it. But nobody's able to get Black Flag. Jesus. Yeah, I see him chasing after the train, yapping at me. But I left him there. That's it. End of story. I hope the cops picked him up. Got him a better home. I think about that damn dog every day. Here's to Black Flag. Post. Uh. That sucks, Hannah. We lost a dog too, little mushroom. It's hard, but shit. That's life. So you gotta walk on. Jeez. Sorry, I ruined the mood. Don't worry, hands. We can do worse. Let's hear everybody's worst memory. Fair and square. <laughs> Are you serious? Why the fuck not? We all need to say our piece once in a while. Who's up? Penny? Cool. Bust out the violin. Check this out. Say hello to my little friend. Jinx. Met him dumpster diving in New Mexico. It was cool. The boy had issues. Mood swings, delirious, self-harm, fun shit like that. He seemed to get better with me. I think I loved him. He gave me this coin. Said he never gave his trust in no one before. We used to come here every now and then, hook up on cash, but he disappeared. A few miles north from here, in a pot farm just like this one. 
He went out one night, high as fuck, in Zoom. That was the last time I saw him. Now I gotta hold on to this fucking penny just in case. Hä? Huh. Yeah, was, was, was? Jesus Christ. That sucks, <sighs> brother. Shit like that happened. Hey, what was gerade RB? Was? The guy needed medication. Sure did. I just hope he's okay. Maybe I'll run into his crazy ass someday. Who knows? It's a small world. I hand him back the trust that he gave me. All right. Bad vibes indeed. Can we do worse? Uh, Jake? Please? Well, just don't laugh. I guess my worst memory is when I lost my faith. Yeah, you mentioned it. What happened? I used to be a sheep. A true hmm. believer. I was raised in Haven Point, Nevada. Small community. We have this amazing reverend. People line up to listen to her. She's intense. But for some reason, things happened to me and I started doubting myself. It kind of escalated. People said I was trouble. I couldn't get the answers I was looking for. Even from my own folks. I know the feeling. I felt so lost. Wasn't sure what to believe anymore. So I left. I just needed to be alone for a while, you know? Find the truth by myself. I'm still looking for it. Jacob, my son. Maybe we are the truth you were looking for. I'm glad I found you guys. I don't know if I'll ever go back there. Not until I get a signal from God, at least. I hope you can. Right, your family misses you a lot. I miss them too. Just not the other stuff. Abby. Family ties are a mess. No. Trust me. I know how that feels to be rejected. Thank you, Sean. What about you, Cassidy? Your turn. Uh, uh uh. Pass. I already sang a song. <laughs> Figures. What about you, Sean? You obviously don't have to talk about that shit show back in Seattle. But if you have something else. Mm, Abby, come. Yeah. I've got a whole bag of these. Don't worry. We're all listening, man. Trüffel, hey, oh yeah, Hank Stamper, oh yeah. Well, this is after me and Daniel took off from Seattle last year. We ended up at this redneck gas station in the middle of nowhere. But our pictures were on, like, every local newspaper. Fucking gutter press. So the owner shows up and knocks my ass out. He tied me up and called the cops. I hope you beat his racist ass to a pulp. Hmm. Actually, Daniel did all the work. He got us out before the cops arrived. Oh, oh. that's my jam. Damn vigilantes. Yeah, life is a bitch. We can only go with the flow. Like a river. Yeah, that's why I'm not dragging around any bad memories. Come on. Bull fucking Oh, you shit, started this man. shit, bitch. Don't punk out now. Uh -huh. yeah, listen, smart asses. I'm just saying... You can't change the past, so you just gotta focus on what's next. Memories are just lessons for the future. The future, huh? What's your big plan, Prophet? Wanna know what my plan is? Picture this. A kick-ass beach house in Costa Rica. Sunshine, feet in the sand, sweet ocean view. We'd be one big, fucked up, happy, dysfunctional family. We just chill and, and sing and drink cocktails out of coconuts. Only thing we need is a little cash along the way. And then, boom. 
<laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. That's your dream? Beach house and coconuts? <laughs> oh, uh, too boring for you? This sounds like my folks' retirement plan to Florida. I don't need anything else than what we already have. Sure, we're working our asses right now, but we can beat it if we want. I'm not gonna settle down. No way. That's how shit starts, you know? When you start having things of your own, things you ought to defend, property, land, family. What do you think you're missing out on now? Um, coconut cocktails? Well, agree to disagree, fucker. Man, I'm too high for your shit. It's time to crash. And Penny goes down. Peace out, brother. Night, night. Looks like we still have some booze left. Here's in. <laughs> oh, twist my arm. A teeny tiny drink. And we need to talk about Sean's hippie hair. Boy needs a real haircut. Oh, hell yes he does. <laughs> now it's your turn to get a trim. Karma. I'll call it a day, too. Night, everyone. Hey. I'm wiped out. Are you ready for bed yet? Ich muss mich beschweren. Ich habe mich geärgert, ja, als wir, als wir der Tütchen, ja, als wir mal ganz kurz am Tütchen gezogen haben. Ich habe mich kurz an Episode 1 erinnert, ne, wo die dann irgendwie auch über Kiffen geredet haben, bla bla bla. Ähm, und dann dachte ich, huch, dann dachte ich halt, ja, ich wusste nicht, dass, dass der Daniel mit am Feuer sitzt, hätte ich mir wahrscheinlich auch denken sollen. Habe ich einfach so, ja komm, machst du mal. Ähm, und das hat sich das Spiel gemerkt. Weißt du, da kommt sofort die Melodie. Die, 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 die. Das wird sich Daniel für die Zukunft merken. Dieses Gameplay geht nur noch Downhill. Weißt du, aber wenn ich an einem Lagerfeuer erzähle, wie unser kleiner Bruder der Held des Tages war bei diesem scheiß Rassistentypen, der uns damals vermöbelt hat an der Tankstelle, weißt du, da merkt sich das Spiel nichts. Da erwähne ich Daniel, also Daniel, der ja, der ja wachsen sein will und, ne, oder, weißt du ja, und ich erwähne ihn als Held des Tages, als Held im Erdbeerfeld und wie, wie gut er alles gemanagt hat und dass er uns eigentlich alle gerettet hat und da rausgeholt hat und das Spiel so... Pff, warum wird sich sowas nicht gemerkt? Das finde ich, das ist doch wichtig, dass wir das gemacht haben. Wie wir da hingekommen sind, war auch nicht so einfach mit diesem, dass man plötzlich RB drucken muss, um irgendwas zu sagen. Das war plötzlich irgendwie auch eine ganz neue Steuerung, die gar nicht vorgestellt wurde und dann aber mit so einem Timer, der wupp, einfach wegläuft und du musst dann auch lesen, was du dann sagst und dann ist der Timer aber schon ausgelaufen. Stell doch sowas vor im Spiel. Mann, ich, wir, wir wissen nicht, dass das da kommt und plötzlich ist die Option wieder weg und dann muss halt ganz schnell lesen, der Timer ist aber super schnell. Ha, Spiel. So, Haare schneiden lassen, mit Daniel schlafen gehen. Der Daniel, ich bin ganz ehrlich, der Daniel will, dass wir mehr Zeit miteinander verbringen und der will nicht, dass wir so oft mit den Freunden hier abhängen. Ich würde mir die Haare schneiden lassen, normalerweise für, ne, damit ich weiß, wie es hinterher aussieht und bestimmt eine coole Sequenz, aber für Brüderlein gehen wir mal früher schlafen, vielleicht können wir noch ein bisschen quatschen, bis er einpennt. Ähm, wir müssen mehr für unseren kleinen Bruder da sein, damit er nicht austickt irgendwie. Das finde ich irgendwie wichtig, weil der hat ja momentan seine schwierige Übergangsphase, er wird immer noch, er wird noch rebellischer als vorher schon. Und das heißt, ab und zu muss man ihn bewusst losschlagen, damit er Ruhe gibt. Ähm, komm, ich würde sagen, erstmal, ich weiß, New Family, we are your new family, la la la. Aber wir dürfen dabei unsere Old Family, unsere eigentliche Family, mit der wir weiterziehen letzten Endes, dürfen wir natürlich auch nicht vergessen. Komm. Yep. I'm ready to crash too. Let's go. What? No. You're gonna miss our makeover skill. I'll fall asleep. And then you'll turn my ear on. Oh, get out of here. Good night, Finn. Night, night. Sweet yeah. dreams, See you in the morning. You didn't have to come with me, you know? I know. Ich fand's wichtig, dass wir das machen. Weil hey. er sich ja schon ein paar Mal beschwert hat auch. Can we talk about what happened on the lake? Yeah. Das war abgefahren, zu riskant, kein Kind mehr. Und das Problem ist, was ich jetzt wieder habe, ich will, ich will gar nicht meckern die ganze Zeit, aber ne, das hatte ich ja bei den anderen Episoden auch schon, ich weiß nicht, was er jetzt sagen wird. Wenn ich jetzt sage, kein Kind mehr, und dann wird er sagen, du denkst, du bist kein Kind mehr? Natürlich bist du noch ein Kind. Ich bin der einzige Erwachsene hier, du dumme Bratze. Dann ist das doof. Aber ich versuche einfach mal, kein Kind mehr, du bist wirklich kein Kind mehr. Familiärer Zuspruch hier, guck mal. Keine 
bummed me out when you said that you weren't a kid anymore. I mean, I know you're not, but I'm going to miss it. I can't help it, Sean. Things are so different now. I miss my friends, my room, my playbots, everything. It all seems so far away now. I know I'm not always nice with you, but things aren't nice anymore. I know. But don't let this change who you are. I just wish I could have a normal life again and stop being so angry all the time. I'm no. just so tired of all this crap. I feel the same way, dude. It's okay. Just don't feed the beast, you know? Yeah. You know, I still like it. But it's kind of tight on me now. Yeah. <laughs> You're too big for it. I am. But I would like to hear about the Wolf Brothers, if that's okay. Just don't tell the others, okay? Promise. All right. Get comfy. Where were we? Oh. Yeah. The Wolf Brothers joined a pack of hounds that roamed all over. Finally, the brothers had found new friends. But the little wolf wasn't so sure about the new pack. He didn't want his brother to run away with them. And so the little wolf would howl and prowl, not knowing what was going on. But he didn't know that nothing could ever separate the Wolf Brothers from each other. Ever. Puh, ich glaube, das war die richtige Entscheidung. Hä, hey, was los? Hä? Hey. Wie soll ich denn verschlafen? Oh nein, oh nein, wir sind schon auf Messerschneide. Warum? Seit wann verschläft denn? Wieso weckt ihn denn keiner?
Schöner Song und damit Tschüss, Monetarisierung, Adieu. <lacht> Ach, schön. Oh, und gleich wird bestimmt alles schief gehen. Nach so einem schönen Song, gleich geht alles wieder in the ass. Gleich kommen die Bullen. Okay. Nicht? This is boring. So, everybody, tell me how you're gonna blow your next payday. The usual. Save it till the next one. <laughs> well, ain't we all stingy now? How about a keg offering for your family, or... Or some hookers, or cocaine? Oh, please. There's a child here. Mm, I think he's heard worse. Besides, he's our mascot now. Oh, I want to buy a bacon burger and a pepperoni pizza. <laughs> Then, a box of Choco Chris and, and a red slushie. Oh, hell yes. S screw the hookers. Bring on the Choco Chris. <laughs> Come on, Sean. Echt dabei. You gotta treat yourself after all this hard work. Ich spare alles. Neue Zahnbürste, Socken. Ja, ja, neue Zahnbürste wäre ganz gut. Und Socken. Ja, Socken wären halt echt super. Mal wieder in den Schuhen. Hm, hier. Okay, that's silly. But I really do need another pair of socks. I wash mine overnight, but they're not always dry the next morning. <lacht> He's got cold feet. <lacht> So that's it, huh? <laughs> you bust your ass all week for nothing? Some of us just got simple needs, princess. Yeah. Like your beach house in Costa Rica? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Let's get this over with. Then... Cassidy, Sean, and, uh, you. Jake. Jake, Jacob. Oh, ich hab dass da irgendeine Scheiße passiert jetzt. Daniel, dude, do you have to do this every week? Adults only. Oh, whatever. I work too. Yes, I know. But we have to keep a low profile. Got it? For the millionth time. Just wait here for a few minutes and don't do anything. Nothing. I won't. Uh -oh. Swear. Uh -oh. Okay. Uh -oh. We'll be right back. Uh oh. For once you're all on time, let's see who wins that farm lotto. Jacob, right? I thought you wouldn't last a day, but you cleaned up. You're all right. Thank you. Thanks. Cassidy, your trims were pretty weak. And Big Joe told me you've been whining a lot. Bet he did. Look, you can bitch all you want as long as you work. Otherwise, you're just taking up space. So get it together. I know, Meryl. Now for Sean. Very nice trims. Good work, kid. Finn, you saved the pots in the greenhouse. And our asses. That's why you keep coming back. You know it, boss. Uh, how about a raise? <clears throat> yeah. Sorry. Now for the moment you've all been waiting for. Get in here, you little asshole! What the fuck? Don't touch me, jerk! Don't move! Now explain! That sneaky fucker! He was snooping around your living room! No, I wasn't! I was just bored, so I came in! Uh, shut up, Daniel! Seriously! Let Shh. him go! I told you. Come on, Meryl! He's a kid, not a thief! You wanna frisk him? <sighs> Look at him! He's just following his big brother! Your brother needs a lesson. You all need a lesson. So first off, no payday. Oh, oh fuck that. No way. Uh, don't do that to us. We earned that money. Sean, you and your brother are fired. 
What? Then don't come back or Big Joe will take care of your ass. Please, Meryl. That's bullshit, man. Man, I, I know you're pissed, but Sean is a good worker. Never brought you any losers, right? Sir. Quiet! Shut the fuck up. Sean, I warned you one too many times. We tried your way. Now it's my turn. Okay, Joseph. Just teach him a lesson. Let me go! Come on, man. Big Joe, what are you gonna do? He's just a little fucking kid! This ain't your business. Think I like it? It's mine. <gasps> Ow! What? <clears throat> okay. Okay, who did that? Who did that? Uh. Nein, ich wollte ich was. My Nein, ich, wieso? Wieso konnte ich jetzt nicht? Da war kein Timer, da war kein. Ich wollte gerade das Gamepad in die Hand nehmen. Ich hab's gerade weggelegt. Bah! Entschuldigung. Ich habe das Gamepad gerade aus der Hand gelegt. Willst du mich verarschen? Boah! Wow. Entschuldigung. Natürlich hätte ich gesagt, ich war's. Danke, dass ich eine Nanosekunde Zeit hatte. Mann, wie mich das nervt. That's it. Believe it or not. Told you it would sound crazy. Fuck. That's mental. Exactly. I knew something was up with you guys. Damn, I would be scared shitless. So, darf ich jetzt? Jetzt, weißt du? Normalerweise wird der Timer angezeigt mit dieser roten Sprechblase. Da war gerade kein Timer dabei, aber offenbar lief ein unsichtbarer Timer plötzlich und ich hatte drei Sekunden Zeit, das Gamepad zu nehmen, das durchzulesen und mich dann noch zu entscheiden. Boah, es ärgert mich einfach. Es sind Weißt du, Entschuldigung, aber es sind diese technischen Sachen hier, auch mit, dass dieser Knopf nicht erklärt wird mit RB beim Lagerfeuer. Ah, Mann, ey. Das ist so ärgerlich, weil ich will ja alles richtig machen, aber wenn du die Chance dazu nicht kriegst, und das war gerade wieder so ein Ding, was nicht gemerkt wird. Weißt du, das wird dann wieder gemerkt. Ah, Entschuldigung. Wir sind vorsichtig, jetzt habe ich die Frage nicht mehr mehr im Kopf. Weil ich mich gerade aufrege. Wir sind vorsichtig, das tue ich. Ja. Uh, yeah. We're careful. I'm always here. In case anything happens. And I practice every day. Man. So, Sean. Maybe this shit is in your DNA too. Do you have a superpower? Nada. Zero. Nothing. Trust me. I tried. Really? When? Do you. Have any idea where it comes from? I mean, it can't be random. Er ist ein Reptiloid. <lacht> hm. I figured it started in Seattle. Maybe the shock triggered something. Fuck, I don't know. But I still don't remember. Don't worry about it. Damn, you're so unique, Daniel. That's why I need your word that you'll keep all this to yourself. Seriously. Oh, this stays right with us. Promise. You can trust us. Jake? I don't know. I mean, this is a big deal, Sean. How long can you keep this a secret? As long as we have to. It's all about keeping Daniel safe. It's my job now, man. What if he has those powers for a reason? Maybe it's our job to help him too. Guide him. What does he mean, Sean? Dude, no. Do not make this into some cosmic bullshit. You still can't tell anybody. Come on. I wouldn't do that to you, Sean. Or Daniel. Oh, this whole thing just blew my mind. I think I need a break. Is that okay? No worries. It's cool. Oh, not after what you guys went through with these bastards. Okay. Talk later. Hmm. He's right. It's fucking bullshit. I know. 
Finn, do you swear? I mean it. No worries, sweetheart. I'd never let anything happen to that little guy. <laughs> He's a true rebel. Thanks, man. For real. <laughs>